Page. Proverbs 1822 says, He who finds a wife finds a good thing and obtains favor from the Lord. And I found the person I didn't know I was searching for in my whole life. You're funny, tremendously smart, bursting with joy, and always ready to create a new story. You're massively talented and passionately driven, and you've more than earned a seat at any table you could ever choose. You're beautiful, you're confident, and you light up every room you walk into. You feel the world deeply and in dazzling color. You never let the unknown or adversity hold you back from stepping out and seizing the day. The journey of getting to know you and falling deeply in love with you has been the most rewarding of my life. I'm so grateful. It's only just getting started. As we stand here in front of our family and dearest friends, the people who have loved us, taught us, grown us, and shaped us, I vow before them and before God to love you and lead you as Christ loves and leads me and to keep our marriage centered on Jesus, seeking first his kingdom and his righteousness. I vow to never stop pursuing you. I vow to be the anchor in every storm. I vow to keep finding new adventures and telling new stories together. I vow to always celebrate with you in the big and the little moments. I vow to make sure you feel loved, cherished, and delighted in. I vow that whatever life has in store for us, we'll face it together, side by side, as a team. For every mountain we'll face, your belay is always on. I love you from the seas to the summit. Levi, you are a mountain man, but you are also a mountain of a man. Strong in adversity, brave in uncertainty, kind in everything. Your physical stature is a mere shadow of the integrity and depth you carry. Your weightiness, balanced by your mischief, wit, and always ready for a good story attitude. I am safe with you, my truest and best self unfolding in your love. You are a great man, made for magnificent things. Infinitely more will change in our lives from this day forward. So I promise steadfastness, faithfulness to you through it, to call you into the fullness of the man the Lord designed you to be. I promise forgiveness and mercy to stay soft to you, to be your companion, your yes to adventure, your smile in a long day, your belay, to find hope in our situations and faith in our challenges, and to always remember the good in you. I do so love you, from the seas to the summits, and I will choose to love you from now until the end of my time. I now pronounce you husband and wife.